Good morning. A tour of everything that we got going on here. So Natasha's mom made these wonderful curtains on the back and on the two sides for us. We haven't got we want to make one more curtain that goes right where the front seats are so that way we kind of block most of our light coming out so we're not as noticeable to people. You can see we got the curtains on, the back windows. We built this shelf here. You can kind of see what we got going on. This is mostly cooking supplies, spices, cups, pots, pans, all that stuff. This is the table. Underneath the table is the sink. So it's a little bit tight. Natasha has her feet down here. We're in cooking mode now. The This is for the heater here. So here's a close-up of the heater. You can see this is where the hot air comes out. This is where cold air comes in. Right inside this middle part is a big steel box that has a combustion chamber in it. If you look really close right here, you can see this is where the combustion chamber exhausts out and under over here right beside it is where it brings in air to burn. She can't scoot any further because the shelf's in the way. You can see me, I'm kind of like in, I don't know, relax mode. <laughs> Basically trying to stay out of Natka's way of cooking mode. The table folds up like that. We have these bungee cords oops, that come around to hold the table up. And then underneath here we have this is for bad water, the used water from the sink. This is our stove that we put up on the table when we want it. Chairs, more pots, pans, random stuff. Um, you come inside, over here in this corner we got our bottle of clean water. This is our propane tank. Um, here we have our electrical panel we got for lights. This one here runs our charging station. And this one here runs the heater. Fan, ignition, like that. Um, we have a carbon detector here, carbon monoxide detector. Underneath here, you can see we got, this is the heater. These are just boxes with our clothes and stuff. Here, you can see the front seat down. The battery, auxiliary battery is underneath here. I put this piece of carpet over it so people are just a little bit safer. Um, what? This is us in bed mode. So this is our home for the next few months. If you're interested to know what it's like to live out of a van and travel across Europe, check us out.